Okay, duck and screamer, 12 angles, okay? Throughout your training, you'll always utilize these 12 angles, whether it's the first six or it's the whole 12, or we sometimes train in quarters as well, while you break them down. So we'll go through those now. So nice and easy, starts in our, in our Adam position. So our, our ready position here. So angle one, okay, is here. So it's a head strike there. That's your head strike for angle one. Okay, bring the stick back. Angle two, head strike. Angle three comes from the top straight the way down on the diagonal. Okay, and then angle four follows the same line as that. Straight up. Take the stick all the way over and back up for angle five, going up straight. And then same again, angle six goes down the line. Angle seven is across the waist. Angle eight is across the waist. And then angle nine is a thrust to the eyes. Okay, angle 10 is a witty shot, which means a bounce back shot. So you hit 10 and then bring it back. And then angle 11, which is that floor wheel. And then from here, we're gonna do 12, we transfer, we turn the heel out with the left hand underneath, and then we bring it up with a high stroke there to the groin, and then go straight back in to our position. So once again, so angle one, angle two, angle three, Angle four, angle five, angle six, angle seven, angle eight, angle nine, angle ten, bringing that foot back, angle eleven, and turn, and then upward stroke for the twelve. So, common mistakes what happens is to get to angle one, most people just drop the stick down here and go here. Okay, try and think of angle one as a slash and a hack. So it's a slash and a hack. So you see how my stick here isn't completely straight like this, okay, just coming straight. So the tip here is hitting the center line with my hand off center, okay? Same as two is the same, don't take two here, across here, two finishes center line. Okay, so you should have angle one here, angle two here. So those are the most common. And as I said there, when we're doing the angle four, take it all the way through, so you keep the rotation for angle five. Not go angle four here, stop, drop your stick and go back up again. Okay, the whole purpose of doing your angles, these are your ABC of striking. So making sure that obviously you're critical, you're clean when you, when, where those strokes are going, that you can see those are the areas that you need to strike to. Plus as well, if you're doing the angles correct, your partner themselves when they're training will obviously be blocking correctly Okay, and obviously countering correctly, or the disarming, etc. Okay, so that's your 12 angles, okay, from Dakiana and Screamer.